and this is also called the dukkha arasatya so getting to know this is the dukkha arasatya getting to know the dukkha arasatya and moving on to sanyukta nikaya 4 loka samude sutre now we are looking at how the world is created we we talk about world when we say world there are two worlds we talk about the world as in uh, the vipaka world and a abhisankara world vipaka world you cannot do anything about the vipaka world because it's already there it's created already so if we try to do anything to do with vipaka world you won't succeed so we need to understand what we need to look at so the abhisankara world is what we create right so that is what we need to uh, look at so in this uh, loka samude loka is the world samude is creating so that is what the loka samude means so how world is created is by raga dvesha moha so you have a vipaka the vipaka are the uh, panchaskande again it's the same thing uh, explained in different ways and in different uh, examples from different sutra so that we are talking about the same thing you understand the same concepts in different uh, perspectives and in different depths right so uh, how the world is created is by raga dvesha and moha so that is the abhisankara world we are talking about so here now i am going to take an example of a girl of about 18 years of age dancing in the house so she is dancing uh, we'll say she is dancing very nicely there is uh, her father mother grandfather grandmother and her brother uh, and uh, her bro- brother's friend present uh, at the at the time so say for example everyone is watching this uh, uh, girl dancing so what what we are trying to look at is how different people attach differently and create the asad or uh, create the pati cha sama upada how it happens right so change in particular and it changes the world you're creating so this is what we are trying to look at now it is the loka uh, loka samode so the world how you're creating your own world is what we are trying to look at right so if the girl was uh, say for example uh, the girl is wearing a, a really nice dress and uh, high heels as well right the girl is dancing let's look at uh, the father for example we will assume the father doesn't like uh, the girl dancing very much because he's not a fond uh, uh, he's not very fond of uh, the daughter uh, doing dancing right but the mother loves it right and the mother is like oh my god she's dancing really nicely look at her and the father is like oh my god she's she doesn't listen to me uh, she's she wants to dance and uh, dancing is not a very good thing for the culture or something for example we'll take it that way and the grandfather uh will take it as the grandfather also is okay with the dancing and he's uh, he's thinking oh she's dancing lovely and uh, and then uh, the grandmother will assume the grandmother doesn't like uh, her dancing at all because in uh, the asian culture they uh, they don't want the the girls to do certain things and they don't want um, to see like a young girl dancing and especially in front of another guy as well so the grandmother is not very happy she is very uh, upset and a little bit angry the brother for the brother it doesn't matter he doesn't he doesn't really care it, it doesn't matter and the other guy loves to see this and he is like he's in uh, he's so attached to say for example he fancies this l- young lady l- young girl and then he's um, say he's in love with her so he's watching this really uh, enjoying himself right so now you have to look at how people different people were attached to this uh, a girl 
and created their own world. So that is what we are trying to look at. And imagine all of a sudden something happened and she slipped and she fell down on the floor. Now all of a sudden everything goes upside down. Everything changes. The father is like, oh, good that this happened. I wanted her to uh, uh, fall down or something. And the mother is like, oh my God, what happened to you? Are you okay? And the grandfather is, will be also like, oh, is she okay? And the grandmother is, will be happy. I didn't want her to dance. That is what happened when you uh, do things that uh, we don't want you to do kind of thing. She will have that kind of mentality and the brother wouldn't mind. He would be doing something else. He is occupied with something else. He doesn't care whether the, the sister is dancing or what, right? And the other guy, now the other guy is worried. The other guy is thinking, oh, he, he was really enjoying it. Now he is suffering. Oh my God, is she okay? But she, he can't get involved too much because the parents probably they don't know about this love affair or something. So now he is worried. Now they created their own worlds again with the attachment, the type of attachment. Right? So this is what you need to see. So that is what Loka Samude Sutra is explaining. So we create our old, our Abhisankara world this way. This is what we do. So we, how we attach with towards the other, the world, we create our world ourselves. So Drahatan Vahanse doesn't get attached to the world. So he, for him, there is no Abhisankara world. He's not creating anything. So that is the difference. And this is what you need to understand.